friends, welcome back. Today we're going to be doing another showmanship video, but we are going to be practicing learning how to show a lamb. Ashley, are you ready? I'm super ready. I brought squirrel. Not exactly what you need for lamb showmanship. I'll try again, but let's go get started. <laughs> I didn't want to be wrong this time. No, wool. Yeah, Not her name feathers. is Prim, and her name is Squirrel. No, 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 wool, wool. I'm wrong. Not feathers. Not hair. Wool, wool. You're not very nice. Now that Ashley finally has the right animal, we're gonna learn how to hold our animal. So you're gonna take your left hand and you're gonna place it underneath the chin. Um, chin, chin. Uh, not quite. So, your left hand, left hand, yes, under the chin, under the chin, uh, other side, other side, no, nope, other side, oh! no, other side, not again. Okay, left hand, left hand, under the chin, there you go, finally. Now, right hand, behind the head here, nope, not Back. behind the... Left hand under the chin. We've gone over this. Under the chin. Mm -hmm. You finally got that part. I got that part. Now, right hand right behind the, the ah! no. no, we have to try something else. Oh, my sheep doesn't want to cooperate. You're the one that doesn't want to cooperate. Oh. Okay, left hand under the chin. Under the chin. Right hand behind the head. Yes. I'm getting it this time. This is a better trained sheep than that other thing you yes. gave me. Let's celebrate with a horn toot. Do you like my shepherding cloak? I love them. With my shepherding staff? Yes. Did you know that historically Sheep and shepherds are mentioned more than 247 times in the Bible. Whoa! Wow. That's a lot. Do you want to know something else that's fun? I do! We have two sheep here. We, we only we have, have three two sheep. sheep. Well, anyhow, we have two sheep here. The one sheep is under a year old. She is considered a lamb. This sheep is four years old and is considered a you. Well, you stink. Well, you are lame. We shall see you later. So now that we have the uh, holding mastered, we need to practice walking our lamb. So with the grip that you have, if you could wake your sheep up, it's tired. You could walk him, her. We're gonna go for a walk? Yes. Big walks? Are we gonna go for a walk? Let's go! You come want on, your on, 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 lamb to walk fluidly okay, okay, okay. with you. She walks next to you. Ah. With your hands placed in the correct position. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Like Maybe this. Maybe you're super good at this one. You need to walk like this with your hands in the right position. I'm super out of breath. A horn toot! <laughs> Did you know? Oh, come on, Judd. Come on. Did you know that sheep have different
different kinds of wool. And we have a wool sheep over here. And not all sheep have wool. This sheep has hair. He's a Katahdin hair sheep. And when it comes to springtime, he's going to actually lose all of his hair and we will not have to shear him. This one we will have to shear quite soon, really, once the weather starts getting warm. What does um, my sheep have? Your sheep has beautiful locks of hair. Thank you! But this is pretty fun. Until this sheep sheds out, he really likes to have massages and he makes really funny faces when he's getting his massages. You are so funny. Okay, fun sheep fact with hair and wool. Bye, crazy fact lady! Okay, we are going to move on from the walking. We are going to learn to brace our lambs. Okay. So let me turn my lamb so that you can see. We are going to set our, so we're going to set our lamb's legs up kind of square. And we are going to push. We're going down. We're going down. Just blow the horn. Why are you hugging the lamb? If today was October 27th, it would be Hug a Lamb Day. Did you know they have that on the calendar? No, I did not. Oh, it's true. It's true. Wow. You know what else is really cool about sheep? What? They can see 300 degrees around their body. Wow. Isn't that interesting? They barely have to turn their head around to see all the way behind them. Wow. Did you also know that if you put a sheep on its back, the sheep cannot get up? But the dog can. So this is what not a dog. <laughs> oh well that sheep will be okay. Alright. Bye bye. Thank you for watching our video. We do actually know what we're doing. Kylie here is a little bit of an expert. I love showing sheep. Last year I did win senior sheep showmanship and got this buckle. Uh, this will be my next fair lamb. Her name is Yorkie. And so keep your eye out for another uh, for a future 4-H video. <laughs> Did you say fun fact? Ah, like this video! Subscribe to our channel! Share it with your friends! <laughs>